Hello guys, it's me, Nikki, and Erin Parsons. <laughs> Hi, I'm so happy to Hi. be with you, Nikki. <laughs> Welcome to the Maybelline channel. Today, Erin and I are gonna be creating the ultimate nude. Nude. <laughs> <laughs> this is the nude, well, I call it my like basic look, the look that just always works, that I always go to, um, and it never fails me. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm really excited to see that because I <laughs> never keep it nude, like, ever. <laughs> okay, I'm so excited. So today we're going to be playing with all Maybelline products, and um, I'm going to be working with one of my favorite, favorite, favorite products in the entire world. Okay, so I'm going to go actually with the Dream Radiant Liquid. Now this is what I use almost for every look that I do, just because it gives me a bit of glow. And yes. because it's a dream radiant, it does make me look younger, I feel like. I'm using the Super Safe Full Coverage Foundation. <laughs> that foundation, it doesn't look heavy at all. It just really makes the skin it look It doesn't, and it perfected. stays on like, oof. I always warm it up. I warm it up on the back of my hand. Oh, I'm that's smart. It, it melts Emulsifies. a little bit nicer. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's cool. And then we bounce. We have to be quiet so you can we can hear your bouncing. People oh. love that. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, I just heard her bounce like live with me. That's in kind real of crazy. life. <laughs> <laughs> I think people are gonna realize now I'm like a huge, huge fan, so <laughs> it's so funny because a lot of people are like, I love your videos. I'm like, oh yeah, really? What do you love about them? They go, My favorite part is the bounce. I'm like <laughs> And when I cut it out, they're like, I can't believe you cut out the bounce today. How dare you? <laughs> yeah, we do love it. Us fans. Stands. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that coverage. Ooh, look at that color match. Ooh. Wow. Ooh, you can't oh, touch it's amazing. Me. No, but like literally, you create the most fascinating looks on models, but I love it when you do your own face. You do? Because it's like you play with the eras and you play with like techniques. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the Instant Age Rewind in Light. All right, now I'm gonna set my under eyes using the Fit Me Loose Powder in five. Mm -hmm. I also use five Fit Me Loose powder. Oh, pale girl. Are we the same? Are we twinning? <laughs> We're the same person. <laughs> no, I, I love this powder. While you contour, I am gonna do the almighty process of my brows. Perfect. I'm gonna try contouring actually with the same product I'm gonna use on my eyes, which is the Smoky Gel Liner. And it's just because I need a really grayish taupe and this is like the perfect color. I know that sounds crazy, but yeah. yeah. No, this is what I mean. This is why I love you. <laughs> I can't. Well, let's see if it doesn't Whereas work. Whereas I go, I'm using a brow pencil for my brows. That's <laughs> It's because I draw that line on my nose. Like, you see, I just did the line on my nose. You do it, the button? Yeah, I do yeah. the button, like Marilyn Monroe. That, that's where I learned it. I love it. <laughs> okay, so I'm doing my brows, and um, if nobody has put you on this product yet, let me be the one for you. This is the Brow Ultra Slim Pencil. These are affordable, they are super, super pigmented, and they are detailed. A lot of like the small ones, they're too soft, so they like break off, or they like are too waxy. Mm -hmm. This one has pigment, but it's a bit, not not like dry, but like drier, mm -hmm. so you can actually like draw hairs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Nikki, I've been watching your channel for a long time, as we all know now, and I've been seeing you use the Ultra Slim for, for years. It's a great product. It's good. Yeah. It's so good. While Nikki does her eyebrows, I'm gonna go ahead and do a little contouring. And I'm gonna add in a little bit of the City Bronzer in 100. Okay, so I'm gonna give Nikki as much time as possible to perfect her eyebrows, because I know what it's like. And while she does that, I'm gonna do mine. I'm gonna use the new Tattoo Studio Brow Pencil, and this is a 36-hour long wear pencil, and the colors are amazing because they're very ash. What I love about this pencil is that I can sharpen it, and then I can draw in, like Nikki had mentioned with her Ultra Slim, you can just draw in little hair strokes, but you can also use it to make the brow much thicker and you just soften it through with the spoolie on the end. Um, this looks so great, and then once it sets, it literally will not come off. <laughs> I'm back. Hello. Nobody responds. <laughs> I said hi. 
I did the outlining using the Brow Ultra Slim and then I filled it in using the new Tattoo Studio uh, Long Wear Brow Pencil. The claim, 36 hours, we need to talk about it. <laughs> Uh, you have a story? Comment down below if you've ever worn makeup for 36 hours. And if you have, <laughs> did your brows last as long as with this pencil? I guess not. So Erin, when did you know that makeup was your life? Like when did you have oh. that like magic moment where you were mm. like, this is going to be my life? Probably when I was like six years old and I saw Marilyn Monroe. Yes. You are obsessed with the classics. I love it. <laughs> well, like for me too, I, I didn't realize it at that time, but I think what I was also so obsessed about with these like glamorous movie stars and with you and people who just generally love makeup is that you use makeup to create your own character, what you're going to feel like that day, yes. you know. It's, it's basically the, the thought that I can think of Marilyn Monroe and I immediately think of red lipstick is just, that's iconic right. to me. Are you doing your eyeshadow? Yes, I am going into the Nudes of New York palette, and I'm just dusting around a couple of like the transition shades to build a little bit of depth, because yes. even though we're doing like the ultimate nude look and I want to keep this softer. Yeah. <laughs> softer. <laughs> um, uh, I still want to have like definition in my crease, because if not, I just look like a, a jellyfish. <laughs> Honestly, for my everyday like fresh, kind of basic face that I, I just feel confident in, I'm using that same what? smoky gel gray. That is what I'm putting on my eyes. And I just put it on my hand and then I run a brush through it. I just like doing makeup oh. with like, kind of like creamy products, so. <laughs> See, there she goes again. She's doing it again. <laughs> I don't know, sometimes it just makes it kind of look like skin and sometimes I want that look, sometimes I don't. But if you want a look where it's kind of like, doesn't feel makeup-y. Powdery. They, yeah. yeah. All right, I'm doing lower lash line. Um, I'm gonna keep it soft. Yeah. Time for lashes. Now you are the queen of mascara. Cause I have like stick straight lashes that always drop down. So I curl yeah, them like me too. heavy duty. But I always also use the waterproof version of mascaras cause that's the only thing that will like keep them up. Yeah. And I, I, I must say, because like I saw uh, so many girls on TikTok rave about the Sky High mascara. Like so many oh, people yeah. raved about it. And then I got <laughs> the waterproof one, and it is so good. You don't have, you, like, you don't even know. It's so good. Yeah. I, it, it really makes the lashes long. It's really a great mascara. I'm using the waterproof now because then I also want to add on the falsies lash lift just because um, I want to kick up the volume. And yeah. that's like my... Wait, I'm gonna do that. Wow, oh. that looks really good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let's okay. layer. Oh, wow, you did yes. that quick. Okay. We have the falsies lash lift. Ooh. <laughs> now, the way you, you take time on your brows is how I take time on my lashes. It's the one thing that takes the longest for me. I just think, so then you get the length and you get the thickness. I mean, Sky High will give you thickness, but then falsies really will pump it up. That's nice. I always curl my lower lashes too. Do you do that? Wow. I, I only on certain models. I've only done it on someone maybe twice in my life. So no, that is oh, wild. You can wait. do that. Look at that. Ooh, hello. I'm going to bronze using my city bronzer in 100. Uh, by the way, if you are a pale ghost out there, so am I, this bronzer works for us. So. We're winning at life. That's, <laughs> that's what I use too. I used a little bit on my contour, but yes, definitely helps. It's so good because it's like not too warm, it's not too dark, it's mm -hmm. affordable, and look at that. Oh, cute, you're contouring your nose. I, I like to watch to. you slide in action. No, oh my god, me too, me too, absolutely. I like the way you contour because you do the bronzer on the center and then you highlight. I do that sometimes because of you. I learned oh! it from you. I inspired the artiste. <laughs> I've been doing this technique lately where I put the blush under my eyes and I just, I just feel like sometimes I go kind of light with my um, concealer and I just feel like sometimes it looks too light. So I like adding the blush on top and then I, I just feel like I look healthier when I have a lot of blush on. <laughs> just underneath? So that's what I'm doing. Yeah, like Wait, in I'm the 30s they used to so put- So like here? Yeah, well, 
Yeah, like in the 30s, they used to do blush like under their eyes. Sometimes they go to like the sides of the nose. But yeah, the blush was like directly under the eye and I just, Look, I yeah, did I it. I love the way it looks. <laughs> do you like it? I love it. <laughs> I look so young. <laughs> That's what I feel like. I feel like it just makes me look more youthful and I don't need to put so much concealer on. Sometimes I'll almost skip the concealer and just put blush on there. So it's been a new thing I'm loving. All right, it's time for the glow and um, I helped Maybelline create this one. So, you know, if you, you know, you know. Um, um, but because I filmed a TikTok for Maybelline, I covered this in glitter because oh. it's better for the transition and like I've been carried away with transitions for the last couple of months so basically my name is transition tutorials at this point so um, I'm gonna highlight <laughs> that's so genius um, oh my it's God. so great because you can put tutorials after anything and it works yeah look um, at me trying to tap off the highlighter like I'm not gonna dip <laughs> back in <laughs> oh Are you loving your nude look right now? Oh, the ultimate nude look. Right now I'm using the ultimate in the color more buff. Mm. Okay. You're so fast, you're already on the lips. I gotta hurry up. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm not I'm not I'm not a pro at this like you, Dang. Oh, this is such an Aaron color. Oh. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Delish. I'm gonna move on to lips now too. You can't tell me anything. That is gorgeous. And this color's rose. Mm. Oh, this formula? Ooh. It's like, it's like soft. It's thin. Yeah. But it's super pig, like look at that pigmented in one swipe. Hello. It's, yeah. It's, it's matte. It's matte but not drying. Oh. Mm hmm And that color, are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, looks stunning. Got a little excited. All right, now I'm taking the Instant Age Rewind again, and I'm just gonna clean up like my corners, and not because I made a mess, but more so because I've been doing this like new thing. So I do this. I do this. Yeah. I will take the concealer and like push it up. Yeah. Oh, that looks so good. And I'm just gonna go way over my lip with this lip liner and purely nude <laughs> while you're doing that. I love this combo. I always like to do two lip liners and then I'll do a gloss because this is my mm. daily look. But I'm gonna use Ultimate in um, another look. Oh. I don't know if I want to do a gloss or not because I love it like this. No, I love the matte, that's so nice. I'm gonna add on the lifter gloss and ice. That is my topping of this nude lip. That's the icing on the cake, on the nude cake, honey. While she does that, okay. Uh, right now, to seal the deal, I'm gonna go in with the Lasting Fix spray. I love going to the pool. <laughs> So you use setting spray. I'm going to use the glass spray as the final look, just to give me a little bit of dew. So this is our final look. Mm -hmm. I love the way we did this today. Yeah. And guess what? If you enjoyed this video today, there's more coming. This is a series and this is just part one. So. If you love this one, get ready for more, baby. <laughs> it's gonna get a lot more right? makeup-y. <laughs> so make sure you subscribe to the Maybelline channel so that every time Maybelline uploads, you get a nice little notification telling you that we're back. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today's video and hopefully we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.